Hello Capricorn, welcome back to the channel. This is Kelsey from Empress of Energy. I'm ready to jump into a current energy check for you guys. So hi, if you're new, please do subscribe. Let's connect energies. If you are returning, welcome back, welcome back. I know it's been a minute. If I'm not tied up, I'm doing personal readings. I'm on YouTube, so I'm doing what I can, guys. But kids are back in school, so I've got more time this week. Okay, so I see your sadness and stress around things just not working out. Things not going to plan, Capricorn. Listen, the reason for that is because you're being protected from it because it's not for you, okay? You are literally being spiritually protected. You're being protected by the universe from these energies that are just not for you. As much as you may want them to be at the time, they're just not. You need to... Oh, someone's going to someone's gonna be asking you out. What? Some of you need to go out celebrate you know just have a laugh with your friends some of you need to go dating i feel like some of you are going to be asked out on a date i feel like someone's got their eye on you let's see oh thank you oh god that fire energy wowzers could be dealing with the aries or a leo or a sag but with the emperor the three of wands the nine of wands and the emperor Someone that's turned the back. This is not your energy. Wow, they've just fully... They weren't joking then when they come out, was there? Someone really wants you... Someone really wants you to know this. Someone that's turned the back on you before now is now looking at you like this. Oh, no, what have I done? Someone's wounded. Someone's wounded. Whoever this emperor is, this is like, you know, boss man, the dad, the husband, the authoritative figure, the controlling one. The arrogant one, the one in control, or seems to be. Someone's like the nine of ones, that's the wounded warrior. Someone doesn't want to give up. It's like, well, they are to turn the back, but they've already turned the back on you. Oh, they are looking at you and the, comp the situation completely different there. The hangman. Oh my god, go and watch. If you're dealing with an Aries, go and watch that reading because that's. The hangman was quite, you know apparent in their energy they need to look at something completely different and it's something from the past as well so if you are dealing with an Aries go and do some cross watching uh, but this is Pisces energy though with a hangman but something needs to be viewed differently that's far too many oh look there's something that's already ended this one more please more for Capricorn. Okay, the Eight of Pentacles. So I feel like for a lot of you, you've become more stable within yourself, within, you know, even within your career. You know, your job's going really well, your home life, something's going really well for you, and someone is seeing that now. You know, your stability, the way that you the way that you've been working on yourself, the way that you've been working on your money as well for a lot of you. Um, it's kind of like, I feel like it's impressing someone. Like your energy at the moment is impressing someone. Wow, the Five of Pentacles. This was all over Aries reading as well. Someone's feeling very abandoned, very ghosted. This is also an energy of someone wanting to work and build on things with you because they now feel ghosted. There's no communication going on between this person. Yeah, this is already someone that's walked away, but I feel like they want to come back. Mm, this could be someone that's gaslighted you before now. Something's, something's happened and the way that you've carried yourself. Okay, this is a secret. This is a mystery. You don't know. You don't know this is what they're... What you, this, you don't know this is how they're feeling, whoever this person is. I'm sure you'll know. Some of you, you are owed an apology for some kind of confusion that they caused you, some kind of emotional confusion. They upset you, like, but not in like any kind of standard way, <laughs> if that makes sense. Yeah, look, someone's looking at you now. Check that look on someone's face. <laughs> you see that? It's like, oh, <laughs> someone is staring at the emperor again. 
This is already someone that's turned the back on you. It really, really is. Tell me about this three of wands. Yeah, there's two of swords. There's no communication between you and this person. This is blocked. Blocked. Either you block them or they block you. But I feel like Wow, strength in the wheel. Yeah, I feel there's something going on within this person's energy and they just don't have a clue what to do with themselves. There's like, you know, typing a message and deleting it and then, you know, and blocking and unblocking and they're trying to gain control of this situation. They're trying to gather the strength. Look, it's like they're obsessed with you. Look. It's like they're trying to tame their own inner demons, their own their own obsessions. They're trying, they are, with the strength. We're dealing with the Leo, and then with the wheel, it's like I feel like they're trying to break their own shitty patterns. To be honest, I feel like they're trying their hardest to break their own toxic cycles. Tell me about this nine of wands, please. Uh oh, here comes the truth. Someone's about to speak some truth. King of Swords, we're dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Someone's coming standing proud. I feel like someone's coming to, and the way that they could have come is like they're, they're proud of themselves. We've got the Four of Cups. Someone wants to tell you how they feel at some kind of loss without you. Look, they're coming in. The Knight of Wands. So much fire energy. There was something about the night time as well in Aries. Honestly, go and watch that reading. Someone's going to send a message at night time. Through the night. It's going to be very shocking, unexpected in some way. It's going to be like some truth over how they've not been able... Someone's thinking about you a lot. But it's over what, they, what they've done. It's over what they've done. Someone's going to express something about it. I don't know if it's in like some kind of selfish way. Um, I feel like there could be an age difference involved here. Could be done with an earth sign. But, sorry, you are the earth sign. Yeah. <laughs> could be dealing with another earth sign, of course. But it's like, you don't expect this at all. You don't see this coming. Just be careful of, you know, doing it to make the cells feel better. So just watch how they come in. Tell me about this emperor, please. Oh, wow. Okay, the star, Aquarius energy. Look at, look at the image on this card. It's absolutely stunning. It's like the rain is pouring on this person and it's like they're having an out-of-body experience in some degree and it's like all they can see is you. All they can see is you whilst... And it's like... You're so attractive. <laughs> You're so attractive. Wow. Yeah, this is your ex. Six of Cups. The King of Pentacles. This is someone from the past. This is someone from the past. It's like... I feel like this person is very, very, very controlling. Or they have been. They have been. But this is... They've not took their eye off you for one second. Let me tell you that right now. They've not took you... Whatever you may know or think you know. However much you might communicate with this person... They have not took their eyes off you for a second, even though you don't chat. They don't let you know this. You think their back's turned. It's definitely not. Quite the opposite. Yeah, they're not telling you this at all. They're keeping this very much to themselves. They're doing it in the dark. They're doing it in the shadows. They're lurking. Um, hmm. The light's about to be exposed, though. Look how bright that is. All these, all these dark little secrets, they're all coming out. Tell me about this hangman, please. Okay, the four of wands, the five of swords and the five of cups. This was a marriage for some of you. This was a marriage. This was a serious commitment. This was something that you shared a home with. They're not telling you how sad they are. Well, the five of swords and the five of cups, they're not telling you how much, possibly doing a lot of shadow work as well, to be honest, but they know what they've done. But they're just not telling you what they're feeling. They're keeping it to themselves. You know, they know that you they've left you on the floor down here. And they, they seem proud doing it. But it's not. It's, you know, they really regret it now. There was like a perfect balance between the two of you. In some way. Someone's missing someone a lot. But they're not telling anyone. There's a lot of focus on the past here. 
Tell me about this. Tell me about this Ace of, Eight of Pentacles, please, Wolf. Okay, we've got the Fool, the Hierophant, Aries Energy, Taurus Energy. Oh, okay. So someone's ready to take a leap, but again, it's I feel like it's at night time. It's I don't know, we're getting darker, darker evenings, aren't we now? So it's going into Christmas time. So we've got more. You know, people tend to feel a bit more comfortable and safe at night, don't they? Like, just expect something message-wise coming through at night time. You just don't see this coming. You're too busy. Look, you're completely facing the other way. The higher friend of the Queen of Pentacles, that's you. And this fool is jumping right towards you and you just do not expect it. You don't see it coming. You don't know how it could possibly happen either for some of you because you've turned your back and you've stayed there. Like, you, you know... There's no communication. I strongly feel that. But listen, this person's not talked their eye off you for a second. They love you. They love you. They see you absolutely stunning. Wow, absolutely stunning. They're watching you online. They're watching what you're doing. And they're loving what you're doing. Like, they, there's something like you're doing, Capricorn, which is, you know, it's really appealing to them. It's drawing them in. Tell me about this five of pentacles, please. Wow. Ten of pentacles, the five of wands. So this was definitely a marriage for some of you. This was combined abundance. This could have been something absolutely huge, but there was a major argument. There was a big fallout. This could have been more than one person involved. I feel like some of you could have had two people fighting, you know. This could have been within a family. This could have caused arguments within a family. Um, you know, you had so much patience though with this. You waited, you tried, you would have done anything in your mind, I feel, to have this go your way. But it didn't. And at that time, this person didn't choose you. So that's why there was an element of ghosting. They was getting out of it, you had to leave. Someone, I feel like someone let you go as well. Someone let you go, you know, you... Yeah, I feel like you surrendered to what was happening and you just allowed, you know, you just went with the process, you trusted the process, you trusted the divine. And this person didn't necessarily come fighting for you. They let you go. They're sorry about that. They really want to make things right. Wow, what reading. Well, that's what I have for you, Capricorn. Please do let me know if these messages were for you. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and I shall see you all in the next one. Take care, guys.